Hi folks, this is Grant with Texas Cattle Company. I would like to introduce to you a new portfolio of wines from the Wild Horse Winery and Vineyard. Wild Horse is located in the central coast of California in the heart of wine country. Clay Brock, director of winemaking for Wild Horse, believes that the free spirit attitude and a passion for winemaking is what makes Wild Horse unique. It's located just south of Paso Robles in Templeton, California. Wild Horse is comprised of 16 diverse appellations and over 50 vineyards. Alan Mack with Constellation Wines, visited Wild Horse and Phil Clay giving a tour of the winery just for Texas Cattle Company. And I'd like to share it with you right now. Enjoy the video. Hey there, I'm Clay Brock, General Manager and Winemaker here at Wild Horse Winery, reaching out to my friends at the Texas Cattle Company. Thanks for your support of our wines. We love you, man. Uh, welcome to Wild Horse Winery. We've got a little event going here tonight. and. Uh, I'm here to talk to you a little bit about how we make the wine here at Wild Horse. We're going to take a little cruise through and uh, see some of the action going on right now here during harvest. Uh, it's about the uh, third week of September now and things are starting to heat up. Grapes are coming in. We've got beautiful weather. Everything's looking good. It's showing up to be a great vintage. And uh, you can have lots of nice Pinot Noir, Chardonnay, Merlot, Cabernet Sauvignon to, send it, uh, to, to sell. And, serve to your patrons and enjoy with your dinner so uh, looking forward to get out to florida and, and checking out your operation having a nice dinner with you folks and uh enjoy cheers this is one of our cellar hands here this is caitlin she's an intern from our local university down here cal poly where i'm a graduate from she's doing a great job she kicks ass on making pinot noir you're going to want to try the wine that she's making right now got a bunch of uh Bunch of fresh Pinot Noir, fresh picked Pinot Noir grapes came in today, uh, putting them through the little stemmer operation here. So uh, this is kind of the beginning of the process. It's got picked earlier this morning. They're nice and cold. We're going to give them a gentle destemming and then move them into our open top fermentation where they start to be punched down and pumped over. And eventually they'll go to barrel uh, for 10 to 16 months and end up on your uh, Texas Cattle Company dinner table. Hope you love it. Check it out. Alright, here we are. We got the fruit going into the hopper up on top, being dumped uh, very gently into the Delta E4 destemmer. No crusher rollers, so lots of whole berries falling into this one ton bin. And then we're going to pick it up and we're going to drive it into our fermentation room and we're going to dump that bin into our open top from, uh, fermentation vessels. So no pumps throughout this process. Very gentle handling because Pinot Noir is a really thin skin grape and it's important that it gets special handling. This is our uh, open top tank. The fruit's been dumped in here. Uh, we've pitched it with the yeast culture and it's starting to ferment. So we've got a group of folks that come through here twice daily and give this a punch down so they push the cap down into the juice and we get a nice gentle extraction. Get all that beautiful color, delicious tannin, good flavor. Um, that's how we make our pinot. When it's all done, we go ahead and drain it out of the tank and then we climb inside that tank. We shovel all the skins and the seeds out. Throw it into a little press outside, give it a real light squeeze, assemble it with the free run juice, and it ends up uh, in a French oak barrel, soon to be on a Texas cattle company table for your enjoyment. Here we are in our barrel room. We've got 9,000 barrels in here. Uh, so we went through the whole process of the Pinot, gently to stem, into the open toss, punched down, drained off, and then it settles in here for, like I say, 10 to 16 months. And uh, then we finish it off and we bring it to your market. I uh, hope you enjoyed our little tour here. 